Wow, that was really sad and unsatisfying. Oh. That was close. Too close. We brought that trouble on ourselves. By we, you mean me. But at least we, me who went and at shot least we, uh, like he deserved uh, shoot. I'm sure he did. But I've been thinking, what about either. time you stop being the man making them decisions? I'm trying. Are you? I think so. You gotta find some place to lay low. Keep quiet. <sighs> Maybe Dutch was right. Maybe we should have just gone to Tahiti. Is that it with you? Tahiti or killing? Come on, John. Please, try. Try what? We gotta live somewhere for more than just a few weeks. Okay. Let's see what we can find in... in Strawberry. What do you know about Strawberry? I know they like good, honest... He looks really good like that. I think you should do that killers. look. So make yourself good and honest. I am always honest. Maybe not always good. But I'm always honest. My that was so depressing. Fools with moral code. Oh, I mean, There's I wouldn't say it's unsatisfying. Look it's just out for depressing. Folks. Stop trying to act like some hero in a book. What do you know about heroes and books? My reading's getting pretty good. Well, read different books then. Damn. The books is Jack's. And, well, maybe he's doing so most of the So all of this, damn, he... You're a bad influence on your mother, boy. He saved them. He Boy. saved them, man. I'm sorry, sir. What was that? I said you're a bad influence. On your okay. mind. With your books. We still got a ways to go, don't we? Which books was that? You know, that dime novel, uh, Boy Calloway and the Men from the Moon, or whatever it was. I'll do my best to find better reading material, Pa. Is that what you like, then? Western tales? Boy. What's that, sir? Do you enjoy tales of the Wild West? Not so much. Anymore. I've been reading about knights. You know, of the round table. The king. What's his name? There's King Arthur. And there's Sir Lancelot. And the Lady Guinevere. And a whole lot of others. Those names. I kind of like them. You know what? So do I. It seems like John is kind of awkward in this role, though. It's not really, doesn't really suit him. He doesn't know how to be the, the noble dad. I don't know if uh, he's picked up that skill in the last few years. glad that I haven't played Red Dead Red 1 because I don't know what to expect and I guess I'm gonna play as John now. I, I was not expecting that from this game but yeah I guess the rest of the game I'm gonna play as John. It's interesting but um I bet that sign says strawberry uh, don't it? I gotta get really plays with your expectations. Place. Been a long time. Yeah, I remember when me and, uh, when Arthur and Micah shot up this place. But, that was another life. Why don't you pull up just here? I'm gonna go see what kind of good, honest work I can find. Grave digging or polishing some rich fella's boots or some such. Me too. See if me and the boy can find some laundry work or something. Well, it would have been nice if we could have gotten that money, but... Hello. Whatever. It's what it is. Help you, son? I'm hoping I can help you. I saw the Help Wanted sign outside. Sure, but uh, you're a bit old to be stacking groceries and running errands, ain't you, son? Well, uh, I ain't too proud to do nothing. Mm. As long as it's honest and it pays. <laughs> <laughs> Time's hard, Mr... Uh, uh, Milton. Jim Milton. Yeah, my wife and I and our boy, we was robbed mm. a few days ago. He looks Lucky good to get with the beard, I think. Was. Now, uh, well, we need money. Uh, there's bad folk out there. <laughs> Tell me about Not it. a wagon by any chance? 
sure. Well, then maybe you could run some goods up to Pronghorn Ranch for me. You know, uh, head west past Owen Gila, then follow the road north, lead you right there. I, I don't know where that is, but I'm sure I can find it. I can leave right now if you'd it, like. It's Getty's place. Fine fella. Uh, where's the wagon? It's just outside. Um, you know, I should go tell my wife, and then I can come back and get loaded. No, my boys can load you up while you go find your wife. Okay. I'm getting a bad feeling about this. Let's go meet Abigail. I mean, those kids seem seemed off. Dude, we're playing as John. Didn't know that was gonna happen. I also didn't know that John was gonna be dressed like a popper. What is that called? Is that how you say the word? Pop popper. He looks like a poor kid in the like. Freaking 1800 thing. Thank you, Doctor. Or something. Hey, <laughs> how you getting on? Looks like a newsboy. Found some work. Me too. Delivering goods out to some ranch. Cleaning a doctor's surgery. Fine living. It is, John. Oh, it is. This is the way to it. I'll take your word on that. What do you suggest now? I'll stay here. Get on with the work. You deliver them goods and then collect me. Okay. And John, I love you. Don't you forget that. Not ever now. I won't. Ain't you cute? Ain't you cute? I really want to change yeah. John's clothes and I can't wait to do that. I might shave his beard a little bit too. If I can do that. I'm pretty sure I can. Pretty good, Milton. Good. Now you ride slow now. Gettys don't want his goods damaged. Of course. Oh, gosh. Yeah, I'll try. Mr. Dickens, I don't think anything was his damaged. overseer. Jim Milton. I'm delivering some supplies from the store in Strawberry. Okay. This is quite a place. Yes, it's beautiful. Oh. They send everything? Yeah, I think so. So, partner, your boss, he looking for hands? Why? You looking for work? Yeah. My wife. Hmm? We was in business with her family and turned sour. It's a long story. Yeah, I don't know. Married hands. It's a lot of trouble. I'm a good worker. My wife, Agatha, even our boy, Lancelot. We'll all work. Big man around, boy? Lancelot. <laughs> Get the hell out of here. <laughs> now, that ain't very neighborly. And threatening us is neighborly. <laughs> hey. Mind if I enjoy one of these apples? Put that down. <laughs> Delicious. Oh, <laughs> when's uh, Boss Man gonna sell this place, boy? I don't think there's any plans for that. You boys want a drink? It's some fine scotch whiskey. Put that down. Put that down. Oh, these supplies for the season. Get off the farm. Come on. <laughs> we know when we're not wanted. Get down from there. <laughs> 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 Bye, bud. <laughs> Come back here! <laughs> That's my damn wagon! Should have said hi to the stranger, but who cares? You ain't getting away with that! Can you catch this failure? You want your wagon back? This one's got a snow in his boot. Tell Gaddy to take that off the wall. There we go.
Hey. Made a good impression, didn't we? Thank you. Milton, isn't it? Those boys are out of Laramie. Work for Mr. Abel. Thank you. Don't mention it. Listen, I ain't looking for work. We'll work. I can do anything. We got... We got robbed ourselves a few days back. We ain't got married hands here. You're married. I work harder than any one of them. I'm real honest, and my wife, even though she's got fancy thoughts, she'll work. Seem kind of desperate. What trouble you in? No trouble, sir. Aside from her brother, he tricked us and robbed her of her inheritance. We're good people. We'll work. Even Lancelot. What does Mr. Gettys need with a boy? Just another mouth to I feed. I guess it does. Just, He's the brother. Please give us a chance. I can handle myself, okay? You know that already. Yeah. Makes me wonder just who would have robbed you. Someone real but bad. We'll give you a chance. I'll let Mr. Gettys know when him and his wife return tomorrow. Thank you, Mr. Dickens. I'll go get my wife. Nah, no, you stay here. It's getting late. We'll go get her in Strawberry. We'll bring her here tomorrow. We need you around in case any more of them Laramie boys turns up. There's a, a little cabin out yonder past the ranch house. Things work out, y'all can stay there. Nice. Thank you. You'll not regret this. Yep. Go get yourself settled. We'll have work for you tomorrow when Mr. Geddes returns. Okay. Wow. So... We're on a new page in this, uh, in this game. What can I say? New chapter. Epilogue. Boss, firm it, and uh, cry. Okay, let's go say hi to fam. I really want to get some John in some better clothes. These clothes are sad. They're sad, guys. Milton, get over here. Mr. Geddes, this is the new ranch hand I told you about. Well, I heard you had some trouble with your welcome, but you kept your nerve and protected my property. No, it was nothing, sir. Mm. Well, David Geddes, pleased to meet you. John, Jim, hmm. Milton. Thank you for the opportunity, sir. You and Mr. Dickens. Well, you work hard. You be honest, you'll get your keep. I promise you that. Boy has a family. Oh, lucky man. Then you better work extra hard. Good day, Howdy, sir. gentlemen. Sir. You hear that, John, Jim? Extra hard. Hey, hey, get over here. Mr. Dickens? Go find old Jim Milton here, something to do. Make sure he works extra hard. Sure, Mr. Dickens. <laughs> okay. Come on this way. I, I was on my chores anyhow. Say, yeah. Is that your we went from an outlaw to the wagon up there, working uh, basically minimal wage job for teenagers. Hey, is it true what they said about you when you arrived? It, that you ran off those hired guns? Look, can we uh, not discuss this in front of my wife? Oh, uh, no. Sure. Yeah, of course, Mister. I don't want to worry her. Oh, yeah. I hear that. Mrs. Milton! Jim Milton. How fine you seem. This kind man just collected us. Thank you, sir. I think we can be okay here. It's ranching work. This place is kind of... It's fine. But I hear you began your career in ranching by throwing your weight around. Real wise, Jim. What was I supposed uh -oh. to do? The place was getting robbed. So you show everyone who's boss? Real fine. I didn't have much of a choice. I gotta go. Jack, when you're done in here, come on out and lend a hand. I was going to milk the cows. Come on, I'll do it. You? 
are gonna milk the cows? Sure. <laughs> Why not? Oh, uh, I don't know. I, What'd she expect me she to was, do? Uh... I'm a ranch hand. A new one, at that. When you got here, them hired guns? I was just getting my wagon back. That's all. Weren't nothing. Oh, it weren't nothing. It was about time someone stood up to them fellers. No. Oh. Where are you from, anyway, partner? Around, you know. Up north, mostly. Been in these parts before, but that was years ago. Oh, <laughs> it's changed. The rich fellas are coming in and buying everything. The ranches. But... Well, you gotta come up with a good lie, dude. Once were, at least. There is that. Say, if it ain't too personal a question, are you a gunslinger, mister? Oh, good lord, no. Nothing like that. Now, just a ranch hand, then. Just a ranch hand. Failed at a bunch of things, like most men. <laughs> well... I feel a whole heap better having a ranch hand like you around. That is for sure. Man, how long we gotta wait till we shoot feel something? Once you see me work. I played this game to shoot things. <laughs> All right then. Not hey, to here's milk the cows. cows. Yeah, we used to have a bunch of women here did most of the milking. Most of them drifted off. Okay. You fine with milking? You know, I ain't really done much of it. Could never, never really get the hang of it. You serious, mister? Sure. It's Jim. Jim Milton. Hey, sit down, I'll show you how. Approach her calm now. She don't take too kindly to surprises. Really gonna do this game. Other, Jim, this game trolls you sometimes, dude. And it's trolling me right now. Wow. Almost got a pail full. Red Dead Redemption, guys. It's making it seem so much easy. Milking a cow is not hey, this Bobby. easy. Is that your boy? It doesn't sure. come out like that. Lancelot. <laughs> well, hey, Lancelot. <laughs> it takes you like an hey. hour to fill that bucket, man. We're gonna make a dairy made. Either that or the you. only time I milked a cow I did it wrong, but whatever. I never thought I'd see the day. Watch and learn, partner. We all gotta earn our keep. That's enough, Jim. Come on. <laughs> How about you and the boy, uh? Help Can't believe everyone's going with that name. Sure. Come on, son. A lot? Twelve, sir. Ain't that grand. It's such a fine name. I like it. I got... I got imaginative parents, sir. Man. <laughs> I, I know years have passed, now, but... I still haven't gotten got over Arthur. Mr. Dickens said... I know what he said. Here I am. We'll just, you know. I need, to, I need to... Mm -hmm. I need to do some revenge. Okay, I need to kill... I need to kill Dutch. Or slap him in the face or something. Micah definitely needs to okay. die. Well, you get them stalled <sighs> and I'll see you later. Bye. Okay. What do you do with Arthur's hat? Jack, you should be wearing Arthur's hat right now. Try and take some pride in this work, hard as it may be. Boy, bring that wheelbarrow over here and keep it close to me. Yes, sir. Moving up. You're a long way from Angelo Bronte's mansion now. Sorry, sir. Nothing. Wow, this no game really fun. is trolling us. We're literally picking up shit right now. <laughs> oh my god. Literally picking up shit. Get used to it. Also get Guns used to smelling like shit. Shoveling. Great. Uh, this is the least fun job. A farm. Yeah, exactly. 
exactly. This game is trolling us, guys. It's trolling us. We literally went from redemption to fucking picking up shit. This is a dog's work. God damn. Reckon even your mother would say we're almost done here. You finish things up, I'll go check one. on her. Okay. Lands a lot. Yep. I was just gonna take a short break. It does feel better to make an honest living in real life, but in a video game, I don't want to shovel poop. Come on now. The last time I was on a farm, I nearly got stampeded by all the cows and, uh, and all the bulls. And I was like, no, never again. Also, I was, re I was really dumb because I lived in Florida, so I just thought, oh, you know, wear flip-flops all the time, right? Don't ever wear flip-flops on a farm. My feet were completely covered in manure. So that was fun. That's what happens when it rains. Everything just becomes hey. a manure spot. Hey. Where's Jack? Shoveling shit in pursuit of the better life you want? Same he looks so been. much better like this. Long Dude, I'm gonna keep his hair and his... Oh, I'm no. keep his hair like that and his beard. Yes, maybe we can last here. Survive. Do a little better than survive for once. I'm tired of fleeing, John. So, well, you know. Me too. Hmm. Are you gonna make out after he just shoveled poop? Dude, he's literally been shovel shoveling poop. But that's okay, you can get it on. You can get it on. I approve. <laughs> they did, they got it on. I'll put he some was covered in on. poop. <laughs> Is he wearing Arthur's hat? Oh, I think he is. Wait, is he? No, I can't. I can't see. Is this Arthur's hat? I can't tell. I'm pretty sure that he wears Arthur's hat in Red Dead 1. Two, which is really cool. Okay. David. Tom. Let's get the fun work down, then. Is this my horse? I'm back, girl. Rachel. Okay, let's ride Rachel around. That's a good horse. It's a sturdy horse. Go do some work. This is a really pretty place, though. You gotta, gotta admit, it kinda reminds me of a place I stayed in a, in Austria. Not sure why I'm bothering taking the road, but who cares? I don't want to walk. That's why. Yeah, I totally could have walked that, but who hey, cares? Hey, Milton, <laughs> can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. Can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. Shoot we was people. in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. It's so free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. But I will work hard, and I learn 
fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. Yep. There's plenty more to do. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. You know, John, I love this for you, Choose but I don't want to do it for it you. <laughs> okay. Now, lift up the other side. I got to line up, see? Now the next rail. Oh, God. Okay. That's it. Fine. Oh, gosh. Maybe this is the most boring well, mission okay. in the game. Go to the next maybe. post and pound that in. Uh, and maybe I'm gonna make y'all want do it with I me. I other matters to attend to, but... There's you guys gotta watch all of it. It's very important to the, right. the story, okay? So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. It's very important okay. and you have to watch every second of it. Don't you dare click away. Milton? Uh, just the basics. Don't make him mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton? Angus is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Come on! Move! Oh. 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 I'll get him. Get a rope on. Try and calm him down. No, no. Oh, God. Come on. Let's talk. Stop. No! I gotta build that! <laughs> That's exactly what I was thinking. Gosh. Bad bull! <laughs> Timber on you. How am I gonna calm this thing down? You don't look like you're gonna wind down. <laughs> but I'll try. Whoa there. Whoa there. Easy. Easy. Don't. It ain't so bad. Nice and easy now, boy. There, there. There, there. All better? Okay. <laughs> Now come on, you hunger Chuck. Stop. This way. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Woo! Oh, good. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. Boring, 
Hey, I'll spice us up. Spice I'll us up. Is it okay? Yeah, let's spice it up. Thank you. Spice it up. Spice up this last but No! I'm headed to work today myself, uh, Jack. Huh? So you yeah. stay out of trouble. Where are you working? I told you. But that Coming is the, the sexiest office. thing you could ever say to me in the morning. Bye. I'll put the coffee Bye. on. <laughs> Give the place a time. Just so you know. Okay, Pa. Sexiest thing in the world. I'll see you later.